everybody, my name's Jessie and welcome to my channel. I wanted to share with you all today my new luggage set. This is actually an overdue video for me because I got these suitcases for Christmas and it is now the middle of July. But I really wanted to share these. I filmed the beginning of this back in January, took a couple of trips and pretty much just forgot to finish this video. So here it is. I do a lot of traveling for work and for fun and I basically just ran right through my last luggage set. I did a review on that as well but long story short they were hard sided cases and they were really pretty really lightweight but they just did not last so I thought I would switch things up this time around and go with some soft sided cases which I got the London Fog Newcastle collection in rose gold. So I will share a little look at that right here. So here I have the whole set and starting on the left that's the roller carry-on bag and the middle two those are the medium and the large suitcases and then on the far right there I have the under seat bag and the cabin bag. Some highlights of the bag include that it's really light and it has the durable honeycomb construction on the inside. It has the 360 wheels and those are really nice. I'm going to start by weighing all the bags. This is the carry-on. It comes in at 7.02 pounds. The medium bag is 8.32 pounds. And the large bag, let's see if it settles down, 9.46 pounds. And not that you'd ever normally check your under seat bag, but it comes to 5.26 pounds and the cabin bag comes to 1.92 pounds. These are the dimensions of all of the bags and all the weights came pretty close to it. Now let's do the fun part. Let's open it up and see. Okay. Okay, so the front pouch is really nice. It seems really durable and it has nice room. So the pouch actually goes all the way up to the top of the suitcase and all the way down as well. Ooh, what is this? I didn't know this came with this. Oh, cool, so this is a TSA three-in-one um, bag. And looking at the inside of the bag, so it has two securing straps for to keep all your clothes on and it's adjustable. This inside pocket, which is really nice to see. Ooh, yeah, the zipper feels good. So you have a mesh zip at the top and two pouches here. This will be good for kind of keeping things organized. Love it. And the inside lining does zip, so you can see that honeycomb construction. Okay, so that makes it so lightweight is that it's foam and, oh, I don't know what this is. It feels durable, but it's really lightweight. Lightweight material. Cool. Like the medium and large bags, this is also extendable. So that extends about, oh, just over an inch of extra space should you need to extend your bag. Now going into the handles, we have the nice handle here. Ooh. Super sleek, as well as a really nice uh, top handle here and a side handle. And that is the carry-on bag. So let's go into the other two checked bags. So now we're moving on to the medium size bag and it's really similar to the carry-on. It has the side handle and the top handle as well as the front pouch. And it extends all the way to the top of the bag and down to the bottom, just like the carry-on. It has the extension as well. Okay, so it's set up just like the carry-on bag, just larger. So it has the um, little straps, inside pouch, mesh bag there as well as two pouches um, on the inside and last but not least we have the largest bag in the collection and as I set it down I noticed that it has a strap on the bottom of the case as well which uh, both the carry-on and the medium size had so that's pretty exciting so you have straps on three of the four sides so if your bag is coming down the carousel it's probably gonna be really easy to grab it let's open it up Again, great inside pocket in the front pouch. You have your bag extender here, about an inch or so extra of room. And voila! So we have 
Same setup as the carry-on and the medium sized bag, although everything is slightly larger since it's the largest bag. Focusing in on the detail of the wheels. So there are eight wheels total on the bag and each of these wheels move individually, which is unlike any other suitcase I've had before with really good 360 range of motion. Next, let's take a look at this under the seat bag, which is really nice because it's considered airline carry-on friendly, which I know the other bag I have that is uh, classified as like a carry-on size bag sometimes doesn't meet the airline requirements for how small the bags have to be, especially if you're traveling basic economy where sometimes your bag is has to pretty much be a backpack. Um, but this falls under the under the seat guidelines and as you can see here, it should fit right under the seat. So let's open it up. In the front we have a nice zipper pocket, as you can see here, as well as a zipper on the top of the bag. This pocket goes down to about here. Moving on to the inside of the bag. Ooh, okay. So you have this plastic lined uh, double zipper. So you have two pouches here. And then a mesh lined compartment here. So let's sit this baby up. And then on the inside, this is also connected with zippers. So you can release that part down. Ooh. Okay, so this must be for um, electronics because this is a neoprene kind of squishy Couch where you could put um, a tablet. It looks like about the size of a tablet. It's about a foot long. And then the inside is all one compartment here. So it looks like that. This bag also features side zippers on each side of the bag. So this is really neat. And it has, oh cool, it has a plastic pouch and a mesh pocket. And it goes all the way down. That's really nice. And let's see what's on the other side. And this side has two mesh pockets. Another great feature that this bag has too is one of these straps that you can put around your larger luggage. So you would strap this around the handle of the full size luggage. And that's really cool. And then it has Velcro, so it stays sleek when you're not using it on the back of the luggage. Super cool. This bag has uh, two wheels on the bag, so just one here and one here on the back of the suitcase, and then um, stoppers, uh, like a brake system on the front. And last but not least, we have our cabin bag, which is super cute, and I think just a great bag to have. It ha has open side pockets on both sides. Going into the front of the bag. So this front pocket's really good. It has a catch on the sides that you wouldn't lose things out of the side of your bag and it's just one open compartment there. Ooh. So the inside of the bag is all one compartment except for this zipper pouch. Okay, moving to the back. If you unzip this, so this was this little zipper on the bottom, you can slide through the Velcro slide this bag on top of your luggage as well. So you would put this on the handle of your luggage. Like, ta-da! However, if you, I guess if you were to leave this closed, this doubles as another compartment for you to keep your stuff in. That is cool. So here are the bags on the handles of the roller cases. And as you can see, I secured it by attaching the Velcro. Boop! and attaching the Velcro on this one as well. And it just makes traveling through the airport so much easier without all those bags rolling around. And now I think it's time to rip the band-aids, so to speak, and uh, cut off the tags. Ta-da! And that, my friends, is the London Fog Newcastle Collection Rose Gold Bags. So as you can see, my first impression of these bags was great and I was so excited and happy to see that they really traveled well. Before COVID, I had the opportunity to take these bags uh, with me when I went on a couple of plane rides, a cruise, a train, so they did get a little bit of love and they really held up great. 
My only complaint is that because they're in that light rose gold color, they do get dirty easily. So my recommendation would be to get those removable suitcase covers that are washable. That way it's just a lot easier to clean those than to clean your whole suitcase after every time you travel. But other than that setback, I love these bags. They're so great to travel with. They're lightweight. The wheels are amazing. Super easy to move and roll around. I love how they're easy to pack with all the different compartments. I felt very organized and overall I was just really impressed. And they're also really pretty. I hope you all enjoyed this video and found it helpful. If you did, be sure to give it a thumbs up and um, if you want to subscribe, that would be really awesome too. That's all I have for now. Thanks so much for watching everybody. See you next time. Bye.